Virgin Media Shorts, championing undiscovered talent. We're here on the red carpet at the Virgin Media Shorts Awards with Ian Bucknell. Hi. Hi. Now, where did you get the idea for RVG? Um, probably when I was eight, looking at a traffic light and just thinking, wouldn't it be cool if they came to life and chased each other around and got into various scrapes, I think. I so. love that, how your imagination just came to life then. Yeah, being a filmmaker gives you an excuse to bring these stupid childhood fantasies to life, basically, yeah. Brilliant. Now, is there a theme to the film? Uh, the theme is the rise of the underdog. Uh, Red represents the underdog, the sort of put-upon character, maybe like Tom, Tom in Tom and Jerry or, Road, or you know, the coyote in Roadrunner. That kind of, you're supposed to root for the red guy okay. in a big way. But who comes out on top in the end, red or green? I think, I don't know, I think green... Well, yeah. maybe we shouldn't say, you know, I mean... It's ambiguous. Yeah, it gives, gives it away. Yep. Open to interpretation, perhaps? Well, how, long is, how, how long has the battle been going on yeah. and how long will it continue? I mean, so maybe we just stop in the middle of their chase. We have a lot of sequels there. Yeah, <laughs> loads of, loads of, There's a whole highway code full of potential that we could exactly, use. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, now, there's no real budget. You wrote, co-shot, directed, co-starred and edited and used a location which was freely available. Was there a deliberate decision to make a film which stood out because of the strength of the idea? Definitely. Uh, my producer, Brett, here, um, Hello. definitely encouraged me a lot to, to, to kind of pull it out of a drawer and, and get it going. Uh, we really loved the idea that it was simple, colour-coded, the strength of the idea, the simple lines of storytelling. Uh, Andrew here did a really great score. Hi. <laughs> and so it was, it's kind of that thing of we shot the opening and the ending, didn't we? So we, we knew how it was going to bookend. And then it was, you had lots of sketches to put in between the sort of bookend. So it was kind of constructed in that way, wasn't it? So it's, yeah, it's sort absolutely. Of, yeah. Yeah. And what advice do you have for anyone who's thinking of entering next year? Don't wait, make something. Um, it's, the, the strength of the idea is everything. I mean, our idea cost nothing. We did it in our spare time. I mean, Brett and Andrew kindly gave up a lot of their spare time. But if you're dedicated, if you really want to make it happen, then you have every chance of ending up here on this red carpet, like me. And what are you going to do if you win the prize money? Uh, I'm going to get this man and this man to come, to come together and make a really great short. We'll develop it and we'll hopefully get something strong enough that we can develop into a feature film later on down the line. That's Brilliant. The and have a big party as well. Big party. Embezzle party. the money, yeah. <laughs> That's a good idea. everyone here as well. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks so much. Best of luck, guys. We'll Thank see you, you later. Thank you very much. Cheers. Okay. Virgin Media Shorts. Championing undiscovered talent.